Now, the resort opened in December 2011. It features 306 guest rooms, including four standalone villas. One of these villas is where I'll be staying in the second part of my trip here to Abu Dhabi. Number 719, 200 square meters of luxury beach villa. Now, Park Hyatt's have a very distinct look, elegant but sophisticated, using dark woods. The flooring, which is light hardwood, comes from Finland. And by the way, all the marble that you see here comes from Oman and from Greece. What do I get? Well, this is ideal for a family of four plus a maid, because there's a maid's room. The second bedroom has two comfortable looking single beds and bath and shower. There's also a butler's pantry with a separate entrance, which means your butler can come in and prepare meals, because in here in the living room, you've got a dining table for four. There's also a bar, and they've left me one of my favorite bottles of champagne over there. A lovely sitting area, state-of-the-art audio-visual system. And to the right there, we have the master bedroom where I'm staying, king-size bed, beautiful chaise long, and a superb marble bathroom with a deep sunken bath, freestanding shower and lots and lots of storage space in a changing room. This is the kind of place that I would stay in when I'm on a beach holiday, but I get more and it's just through here. Now each of the four villas offers two outdoor spaces. One, which is your own spa, complete with masseuse. Of course, each of the villas has a 24-hour butler service. But out here, you get your own private garden, complete with a 20-square-meter pool, an alfresco dining area, and a day bed. Most importantly, you get this superb view of the sea. Every evening and every morning, I'm going to be out on the beach with a cup of tea and a cigar, taking in the spectacular sunsets and sunrises that this resort has to offer.